Our next comic has performed for U.S. troops in Afghanistan, South Korea, and Africa. She's a roundtable regular and writer on Chelsea Lately and stars in Showtime stand-up special Live from Amsterdam. Make some noise for Christina Pajutsky. Good. I um, I just ate like four hot dogs uh, before I got here. Okay, five. I had five. One fell on the ground, and I was like, "Screw it! I'm just gonna, I'm gonna eat it." Cause I love hot. Why, when you're eating a hot dog, does everybody want to tell you what's inside of them, though, right? You got that friend that's like, "Hey, Christina, you know what's in your hot dog?" You know it's in your hot dog. And then you have to explain, like, look, dude, I don't eat hot dogs because I run marathons. <laughs> I eat hot dogs because, like, I hate myself. I'm just saying. Well, no, you don't see, like, athletes eating hot dogs, right? Like, you don't see that guy. Who's that guy who rides the bicycles with one bean bag? <laughs> yeah, Louis Armstrong. You don't see that guy eating Oscar Myers before a race. But no, I was watching my favorite show before I came over here, a little show on MTV called 16 and Pregnant. <laughs> yeah, oh my God, is that the best? 16 and Pregnant, or as I like to call it, good luck, stupid. <laughs> right, because that is a bad idea, having kids at 16. Because when you think about who you were at 16, Right, when I was 16, I was goth. You guys know, you guys know what those are, goth kids? You know, those idiots that wear all black? And it's like all the fun of being dead, except nobody cares. <laughs> nobody cries for you. So if I had a kid at 16, I would have named it like Voldemort or something <laughs> stupid, you know? I don't even know why I bother watching TV. I feel like it just makes you feel bad about yourself. Like, have you guys seen that commercial where the woman with the English accent chastises you about your eyelashes? You seen that where they're like, would you like your eyelashes to be a thousand times longer? <laughs> would you like your eyelashes to curl back into your forehead? And then you have to be like, whoa, wait a minute, dude. Like, I don't ever think about my eyelashes. <laughs> right? Unless I'm lighting a cigarette off the stove. <laughs> then you think about them for like six to eight months. But I don't get it. And I don't like those commercials, like for skin creams that claim to fight aging. That's the best, right? Fight aging like it's a battle that can be won. <laughs> Right, like, hey, Christina, did you hear who won the war on aging? <laughs> yeah, dude, death. <laughs> death wins, like, yeah. And why do you want to stay young forever? Like, I don't want to be 20 years old again, because young people are so stupid. <laughs> they are, they suck, young people suck. And they look amazing, but they make bad decisions, okay? And I know this, because I have the tramp stamp to prove it. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, thank you. Oh, yes, it's of a Chinese dragon. And it symbolizes Jose Cuervo and regret. I like being my age, like I'm not ashamed. I'm 35 years old. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm 35 and I'm married and I love it because I can finally just give up, just <laughs> Right? Like, yeah, you bought the cow, sucker. <laughs> Moo! And I feel confident. Like, my body is just dog crap. But up here... <laughs> and I was telling my husband, I was like, sweetie, I feel so good at this age. You know, like, I'm so good. I just, I feel like I could really just crush a lot of dudes. <laughs> you know what I mean? I could just devastate guys. And not that I would, because I'm married, but I feel confident, you know? And you know who's the first one I would do? I would just devastate that Justin Bieber. <laughs> yeah, isn't he adorable? Justin's so pretty. He is growing into a lovely Hillary Swank. <laughs> oh, I love him. I mean, 
because here's the thing. When I was in my 20s, I was too nervous to sleep around. You know, I was always like, no, I'm chunky, I'm sweaty, I'm gonna get an STD. <laughs> but now at 35, I'm like, yeah, I'm chunky. And I'm sweaty. And I can afford health insurance. So, <laughs> let's do this. Thank you, guys. Yeah.